sight of Amarna is a Khitatun, the new capital of King Akhenaton. It was known for the old archaeologists like Lepsis and Wilkinson and others, who dedicated their lives to the study of Egyptology. But this site was placed under spotlights only in 1887, after a great discovery in it. It was a sunny day when a peasant was searching this monumental site for manure of cattle to use it as a fuel for her oven, a method that is still used till today in the villages. The woman, while digging with her hand, found a small room that was used in the past as a storage. It was a place where the documents of the pharaoh were kept in archives. Seals over bricks told us this information. This fortunate woman found 360 tablets of clay. The tablets were written in cuneiform, and knowing they must be valuable, she transported them over the back of her donkey and sold them to her neighbor for 10 piastres, which is a tenth of an Egyptian pound. In the beginning, she thought she made a great deal, since the buyer found it hard to sell. No wonder, for nothing in their shape was enticing to buy. Artifacts dealers sent them to Dr. Opper in Paris, who replied that they are new, and sent them back to Egypt, where they were transported to Luxor to be sold. Unfortunately, most of the pieces were broken, and their value was only found then. Thus the British Museum and Berlin Museum bought most of what was left from that valuable storage. Then the Louvre Museum and St. Petersburg Museum took over part of them, in addition to what was leaked to private societies. As for the Egyptian Museum, its share was a tiny bit of what should have been all in its possession, and what was taken and displayed in the world's museums was never given back to Egypt.